the tugboat, for its size, is the most powerful craft to float. And the star talks are the power between the docks and waterways that make up with the big city port. This is Tugs. In the 1920s, Big City Port was the biggest harbor in the world. It was a time of great opportunity. Nobody knew it. Nobody knew it then. And the hardworking Tugs, who knows the straight and big, a big cards are popular with everyone from the tramp steampers to the ocean liners. The important jobs to keep with the Optons night and day, and day, my tugs were no exceptions. I had three harbor tugs, OJ, the paddle steamer, warrior Big Mac, a rare tug, top hat, one, one little switcher, <laughs> 10 cents, and Hercules, my ocean going tug. They were a good crew and serving the best. They were a good crew serving to be the best port in the port. Not always succeed, but proud of their work. I remember the day that we got our first big break. It started like the most at dawn. Good morning, Starfree. Today I have charged another switcher to help out with the extra work. He's from up. Uh, he's from up river. Ten cents. He'll be working with you, show him the whoops. Sunshine. Settle down, give Sunshine a chance. Now for the really big news. After a whole lot of barging, it looks like we have managed to line the Ocean Garden contract for one of the biggest, biggest lines for around, the Duchess. When she arrives this afternoon, the Star Fleet will bring into the dock. But first, we got to prove ourselves. OJ, you're in charge. Big Mac, you're leading. Top Hat Warrior, you're on the side push. On your way, away, ten cents. So, so, Shantan, so. On your way, ten cents. Show sunshine how to work the uh, done and fast. Now the rest of you, I want you to finish finish early so you get looking yourselves look at spick a span for the Duchess this afternoon. Our biggest rivalry of those days, Captain Zier with his set stacks. He was always looking forward to get further ahead. In the morning, Hercules had an important contract at the coast. I was to lose his great strafe on this very day. I was near the, the most. This was Lucky's yard. And when the boat, this is Lucky's yard. Well, all the harbor's boats repair, and we, and we, this is Lucky's yard, where the harbor's boats repairs were made. Next to it was a seaplane hangar. One of the Star Talks' job was to feel a surprise for Sally. Zip and Sug knew where to exactly find Big Mac. They were waiting for him. Big Mac had no idea the Sug. Big Mac had no idea that the Zed stacks were laying a trap for him. The Star Fleet were doing their best without Big Mac. For a while, it looks like they're going to make it. But Zoran was still waiting for another chance. As the tricky part, as the tricky part for the docks are, option, 
which in stayed at Zorn, and I watched closely. Let's see, Sunshine and Terrence were working hard at their new job when OJ orders Sunshine to ease back. Zorin saw his chance, and when he found no one else is looking, he moved harder on Sunshine. Sunshine went un Sunshine went uh, into the rubber on the big line. Young and May that had happened, the Star Free had to accept help from the Zed Stacks. Ashamed and confused, Sunshine, Sunshine couldn't explain what happened, so he slipped away and with the Star Tugs was still busy. He didn't know the sleepy tramper, Izzy, had been watching the whole incident. A few days ago, we had savage to talk about Sunshine, and he was taken to Lucky's yard. And I'm glad to tell you that little damage was done. As for the story, we learned a valuable lesson here. A lesson about trust and friendship. I think we have 10 cents to thank for that. And for the rest of us, about jumping into conclusions before knowing the truth. Now, I know you're being proud of the story talks. It's, but the most important thing in my feet after a lot of work is that my, my star tugs will always be truth, honest, and forgiving. Now, if you uh, looked at a port, I would like you to, to welcome our new accord. Sunshine, I am proud to have you in my fleet.